All right, I'm going to show you a technique that's used when we have very small pop-outs, bug holes out on a, a floor. This is a process that can be done with using our TX product line. It's very, very simple. I showed you before we shook up our B-side. I'm going to measure a little bit again. And this is a method where you're not spending a whole lot of time mixing and, and going along the, the, the floor. You're able to utilize a empty ketchup bottle. And I'll show you how this is done. You measure out equal parts A and B, pour it directly into the ketchup bottle. I'm not doing much out here because I don't have very many of these small holes. Pour your equal amounts A and B. Then you want to go ahead and add some sand. Now if, you're, if your bug holes are really, really small, you don't need any sand, but out here I know I've got some uh, breakouts around this joint that we're repairing that are a little larger, so I'm going to go ahead and use the sand. Put your top back on, put your thumb on it, and start shaking it up. Basically, I'm just blending it right inside the, uh, the bottle. And then you're able to go along the floor and fill in with our repair product. Now remember, I'm just repairing along the joint here, so this is what I've got to, to work with. But it's, it's very simple. You just squirt it in, so now I'm not bothering pouring it out of the container. I'm just squirting it in. And this works great if you've got small repairs to do all over along the floor. Now remember I told you before that it's a good idea to sprinkle a little bit of sand on the top if, it's, if it looks wet, which this does, so that when we go and grind it down flush, it'll be a nice consistent looking repair. So that's a real fast technique. You saw how fast that was. I can just go along and fill these and that's a great way to do a lot of small bug holes on the floor.